This video is going to demonstrate how to read the results in Excel once the voting is complete. Once the question set is complete, what you need to do is go to your voting browser. At the very bottom of your bro voting browser is the results browser. What you want to do here is extract, save to a known location, The nice thing about this, it will not allow you to open it until you name it. Click Save, and then it will open the results for us in Excel. What we have here is the name of the flip chart, where it's saved, the date it was given, the series of questions here that were asked, who answered them by their name or number, for us we have our number, how many questions were asked, their percentage, and how long it took each student to answer the entire set of questions. Right away we can notice that these are all about the same except for this guy here. Notice his percentage and how many he missed. So that's a really good indication of how that student was thinking at that time. The nice thing is that down below we have some tabs. We can look by question. So we can scroll down and take a look here and seeing that we got half and half. This is something we want to revisit in small groups. We can look student by student and see here they got these correct and how long it took them to answer each question. We can scroll down to find our friend. As we see it took him three seconds where potentially the average time was 10 so they're just potentially guessing here. Then we go to our question page. What this will allow us to do is potentially print this out so you can see what the correct answer is and all the questions that were asked at that time. This has been Viewing Your Question Results in Excel.